congratulations on the success of Succession. Thank you. I meant to ask you, what is happening in the next season? Um, I, I, I know a little bit. Mm. Um, and mm. I can't divulge, obviously. No, no, obviously I don't want you to divulge. Just, just tell me what's exciting. going to happen. Uh, it's in a. It, it's actually in a really mouth-watering place because um, it's so beautifully set up. Where we let you know with Jeremy's yeah. the twist at the end. Yeah. Oh, don't give anything. Seriously, I, I don't no. want to be the guy where you, you looks, accidentally say like, something. Okay. It looks like cousin Greg has gone to the dark. Has gone to Team Kendall, doesn't it? Anyway, yeah, but listen, but seriously, Matthew, I, I don't want you to accidentally let something slip and it to be no. on my thing. Our friendship couldn't yeah. survive it. I, I don't want to yeah, be yeah. that guy, okay? <laughs> you heard about what Rob did? No, oh, he totally screwed me up. You're cancelled after the third series. <laughs> oh, that would be awful, wouldn't it? Yeah, because of you. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I remember being stood outside a restaurant just outside Richmond with you when you were we'd had lunch and you were about to go and do the pilot. And I remember right. you telling me, yeah, I'm going to New York. I'm doing this thing. It's about this media family. I thought, oh, OK. You could argue it's the best thing on the television, Matthew. And your performance is, oh. is it's a performance to be envied. It's a performance to, be, to look at and go, oh, I would love to do that. Tell, tell me about kind. the decisions. It's like, that... like any, and you know this as, you know, you know this as well as anybody, it's... it's it's the writing, it sort of looks after you. It's so good. But you make amazing yeah. choices in it though. You make amazing decisions. The way you play him. So Tom Wamsgans, is that a real name? Wamsgans. Is, is that a real name? Yeah, there's, yeah, it's, I don't know who came up with it. It's so um, good because it's an awkward name, isn't it? And it slightly yeah. makes you think of glands. <laughs> Yeah. Glands and wounds. It's just a. It's just such a wombs gan. It's horrible. It's, it's all there. The characters there in the name, and then the, and then <laughs> and then nobody can really pronounce it properly, you know. Especially Logan, which is always slightly. And the way he's trying to fit in with that, with that brutal family. Tell me about the little things you do in it, like you'll give little waves occasionally, or you'll just be so sort of out of step with the way they, the, and, and you, you judge those. Now listen, I know it's not easy when someone just sits here no. you're blowing smoke <clears throat> and everything, but seriously, it, it's that good what it you just, do. I sort of think of the most toe curling thing I can think of doing and then do it. And then because of the way we shoot, you know, they, it's all quite loose. I sort of do a lot and they probably fill it, you know, they just get rid of lots of stuff and keep the best bits or the bits that work. And... In the little that I've dipped my toes into a world of, I've, I've had the occasional, you know, you dip your toes in that luxury world. It seems oh, yeah. to me like an incredibly accurate depiction of that type of level of luxury. They do have a sort of advisor or advisors on the uber wealthy and how they operate. And in the first series, we had a note from one of these advisors saying, there's too many, too much overcoat, too many scarves and hats and gloves and overcoats, don't need them. The really uber rich don't really need them because they're going from the chopper to the limo, to the apartment, to the office, you know. Yes, yes, they all that's went. so true. All the sort of cashmere overcoats went. That's true, and yet the cashmere itself remains because there's such a lovely collection oh, of suede. sweaters and sweat, it makes beautiful. I've developed an intolerance to cashmere. I've become very sensitive to it. <laughs> Have you? It's nothing to laugh Why? about, Matthew. I'm sorry, I don't know. So, well, that's good. I mean... Well, no, because I love cashmere, but it... it Why, it, does it bring you out in a rash? No, it tickles my nose. My nose starts to run. And if I wear really? cashmere socks, darling, my, my legs start to itch. Really? Yes. So what do you go... Do you like lamb's wool? I, I've gone to cotton. Synthetics. I, I've gone back to cotton. But it does mean that if, if Jesse Armstrong uh, were thinking that they needed a, the shorter Welsh man in the show... Listen, they might, yeah. They, 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 they're not going to come here because I simply couldn't... Well, you can wear sort of silks and linen. Linen is very good. There was a lot of linen on the yacht.